you that I have my colleague from Otuke. Uh, let him come and uh, say what. Just greeting people. Time is not uh, on our side. Um, the Right Honourable Prime Minister of Uganda, uh, all our leaders, our political, cultural, technical and religious uh, for coming to join us in the commemoration of a terrible incident uh, which took place some time back. The Right Honourable Prime Minister, we are grateful because you are an epitome of excellence, of hard work, of cooperation. Uh, we were told uh, that uh, there was once a Prime Minister, just like you, who served for very many years. He served and finished, he never set foot in Lamo. I would want, on behalf of my colleagues and the people of Lamo, from our very bottom of our hearts, to thank you for sparing your time on a very short notice and coming here to join us. As you have been told, I am a neighbor to Honorable Christine from Otuke uh, District, but I'm also the MP for the President. When is it Baralegi, right on the Prime Minister, I'm the MP of the President. <laughs> um, recently, we had a visit by the uh, Minister for Works, General Kadumba Wamala, and he agreed to put a tarmac road from Agwei, which is in our constituency, up to the State Lodge. Chris and I would like to request you that uh, that work should be completed and so that when His Excellency is here, he is on a good road to the State House. <laughs> on the matter of this incident, uh, the right of the Prime Minister, this was a sad incident for Lano. As you know, our people were in an environment of war for 20 years and the culmination was the death of these 300 people and they are all buried inside here. What this reminds us is that war is bad. We as a community, we are a peace-loving people. His Excellency the President got a lot of support from Lama in the last 2021 election and we want to thank him for the peace and the tranquility that we have joined since the war ended. And we want to, you to take to him our hearts of appreciation and goodwill and best wishes for his good health, even as we remember our disability. I just want to add my voice to the one of the local leaders and the cultural leaders that this place should be a historical site a tourism destination, just like in Germany. I was in Germany where the Jews were killed inside Germany, but they have put uh, commemorations there. And when you go to Germany, you have to go and see where the masters took place. I think this place can benefit from such a thing like that. I, I, I want to thank you again that when you go back, when you travel safe, we are always with you and we appreciate you for keeping your office and your doors open. Thank you very much. <laughs>